Hello and welcome. I am delighted to be joined today by Lakshmi Mandiam. She's Vice President, Service Provider, Product Management and Partner Ecosystem at VMware. And Andy Walker, Global Communication and Media Industry Lead at Accenture. Welcome to both of you. Lakshmi, Accenture and VMware announced a new partnership last year. What was the motivation at the time and where do things stand today? It was a tremendous event, I think, for us to announce this partnership because as we think about the rollout of 5G core into the network, there are a lot of complexities. It's a more distributed architecture. Um, there are a lot of cloud native principles that telcos are getting used to that need to be rolled out. And all of this requires the combination of a really strong technology platform alongside a really strong services heritage. And I think the combination of Accenture and VMware delivers that. And over the last year, we've been working together to understand what the customer challenges are, what are the use cases that we need to solve together, and have come up with a plan where we are working in early development together to enable them to get up to speed on our technologies and be able to package up solutions that are going to solve these deployment and not just, you know, day zero, day one, day two operations and bringing these innovative use cases into the CSP's hands. And so I think a year on in that uh, partnership, we're starting to see tangible results at customers and really starting to see the value of what we envisioned a year ago. So it's a really exciting time for us in this partnership. Andy, how is your partnership addressing market needs? Well, so look, when we think about the transformation that's underway with carriers implementing ORAN and VRAN solutions, ultimately they want it to be easy, right? They're looking for the easy button. And so what Accenture and VMware are doing is frankly, we're coming together to pre-develop solutions and packages working in our lab so that we can bring them directly to the carrier. And, and we're really excited about this because it allows us to have an accelerator in the market. There's enough that carriers are worried about that the last thing they need is they're thinking about ORAN is to have their environment be a skunk works. So, so, so really this is about us working together, pre-developing and being able to go to market with powerful solutions. Lakshmi, VMware and Accenture were involved in several of the early Open RAN trials. So where do you expect the technology to evolve or to go in 2022? And what could be the key challenges? So ORAN is a key initiative in the industry to disaggregate the RAN. And one of the essential parts of that is not just the technology aspects of it, but also the deployment and lifecycle management of these new class of applications and functions. So VMware has invested in our RAN intelligent controller platform, and we worked extensively with Accenture at field trials to demonstrate that capabilities. And we see that continuing over the next year and the evolution of an apps ecosystem system that can take advantage of a variety of different use cases that enable CSPs to, again, monetize uh, their investments and rapidly deploy new applications and user experiences that are differentiating. And Accenture is a key partner for us because together we are going to simplify that process and bring the right technologies to play to, to drive CSP success. Andy, could you tell us a bit more about the Cloud Native box? Absolutely. So our Cloud Native, our CNAS box, is something we've been building in our lab with VMware so that we can bring kind of the virtualization layer right into the solution, right? And the, again, this kind of point goes back to there's a box that's already assembled, that's pre-configured, that we can deploy easily and at speed because our carrier, our carrier friends do not have time to, to have us developing and figuring out things on, the, on, on their nickel, right? So we've kind of done this in advance and we're excited about it. Finally, Lakshmi, what's next for your partnership with Accenture? I just think this is the beginning of a great journey that we're going to undertake together as we think about evolutions of technologies and deployments of generational uh, telecom infrastructure. It takes a while. And there are several different nuanced uh, implementations that need to happen based on CSP requirements. And I think working with Accenture, the services play that they provide to provide that flexibility and that bespoke, you know, common things that make, make CSPs successful 
uh, coupled with the technology innovation that we're bringing, I think is a very strong partnership that is going to help advance the cause of new technologies, not just ORAN, but basic cloud infrastructure as it pertains to 5G deployments. So really excited about the partnership and looking forward to continuing it. I completely agree with Lakshmi. You know, I think I would say 20, 2022 and 2023 are really the year of 5G deployments and ORAN, right? And this, this sort of re-architecture of a network is not something that's happened in decades, right? So as the carriers spend hundreds of billions of dollars to roll out 5G in a newly architected environment and model, right, with kind of cloud native solutions, I think what we're putting together is gonna to be incredibly powerful. I think we're gonna see it all over the world. Um, and I'm super excited to be working with, with a partner like VMware on it. Lakshmi, Andy, thank you very much. Thank you.